Hey y'all, how y'all doing? It's your girl, Miss Natural Shay. Welcome and welcome back. Today we are on day number 51 of my fragrance layering combo of the day, Diaries Boo. Okay y'all, let's just jump right on in. Mm -hmm. Okay, so one of my good sis, I forgot her name, but she, um, actually I might put her, uh, if I don't forget, I'll put her um, comment of her fragrance layering combo of the day from she did it in uh day 40 but i got the comment yesterday or the day, the day before but anywho she had mentioned that she used irish spring and i'm like you know what i think she used the irish spring cool blast if i'm not mistaken um but i was like i already have some uh, irish spring original body bars so let me just bust one open okay so that is what i wash my body down in first so I use the Irish Spring. If y'all know about the Irish Spring, it smells really good for to me. It smells really good. It says it's a 12 hour fresh deodorant soap with flaxseed oil. I don't even know what flaxseed oil does. I didn't even know there was a, such a thing as flaxseed oil. I do know about flaxseeds, ground uh, ground up flaxseeds. I do use those when I make um smoothies, but I never heard of flaxseed oil until now. So anywho. It says it washes away bacteria. So this is an oldie, like for real. This is an oldie, but a goodie. I remember growing up, my um sister used to always buy this soap and she would always wash her babies down. Her two daughters, she would always, I would be over here. She would always wash her babies down. And the Irish Spring soap, and it would be smelling so good. I remember that. Um, She also used other soaps too, but I remember her using the Irish Spring soap as well. And it always was smelling good okay so anyway i have grown up with using irish spring but i wasn't even thinking oh let me put this in a shower and go ahead and use it i have used a body wash um and i used to use that for my butt area so i would do the feminine wash in my uh, ginger red area and then in the buttocks area i will use irish spring but it was actually a um the Irish Spring body wash that I will use as well because you know mm -hmm, it gets the odor it gets uh, gets the odor right on up so you you don't have to worry about nothing okay but anywho I wash my body on down in this and it was just very nostalgic for me to use the body bar because I haven't used it in a long time I actually get these for my nephew as well so I just grabbed one up and I was like yes I'm going in with that today and that's what I did so the next product we're going to talk about, uh, this is my, I believe, um, I'm 99.9% .9 like the DNA. <laughs> For the paternity test, I'm 99.9% .9 sure that I have not used this before, but I'm still not for sure, okay? Um, because I don't know if I had this in storage, I'm not sure. But anywho, I grabbed this because I have not used this since I purchased this. And this is from Raw Sugar. Like, I haven't used Raw Sugar in so long. Um, It's the pineapple and my Q, my Kai, something like that, berry and coconut. I'm going to let y'all see it. Y'all can tell me what the name is. M-A-Q-U-I. Never heard of that, berry. But I used this after I showered on down in my Irish Spring and this was a good time this is actually it says it's made with plant uh derived ingredients and cold pressed extracts for positively good clean skin so this was really good i have used um another body wash from them i do like their body scrubs um of course if you guys have used their body scrubs or their body washes chit chat down below because raw sugar used to be popping like probably two three years ago people used to always talk about raw sugar especially their scrubs but here nowadays i don't really hear people talking about the raw sugar but it's still a great product so yes i wash my body down in this and then you already know how i do and probably how y'all do too get out the shower dab 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 on down you know get the excess water off and now it's time for me to go in with the moisture so and this glass right here, and I do not have the bottle. I don't even know where the bottle is. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Anywho, in this bottle, I put not the whole product, but just a little bit of the cocoa butter and shea honey fragrant oil 
by Bath and Body Works. I wish I had it to grab so I could just shut up. Oh, it's right down here. Hold on. <laughs> okay, so I put some of this in this bottle. I just wanted to see how it would do in the bottle with a nozzle. So you do have to be careful because if you put your lotion um in your hand and then boop, 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 it comes out really quick and it can get all over the place and it does get over the place for me it gets on my comforter all the time but anywho that's what i had uh used today and i will finish putting this product in here just to go ahead and fill it up and then so i'm not always you know reaching for this and reaching for this at the same time just to show you guys what i'm using but this is a coco shea honey fragrant rich moisture oil and it has cocoa and shea butter up in that thing and this is a good time from the bath and body works i do not recommend that you spend what is it twenty dollars and 95 cent no ma'am no pam no ham no cheese we are not doing that we only get this product when it is on sale when they have it for like 5.95 or a little bit higher than that <laughs> we're not paying over ten dollars i don't even want y'all to pay ten dollars because when y'all can get a deal get the deal okay but anywho or of course no you can't even get it as a free product no because it's 16.95 if you have a reward you can only spend it on products at 16.95 and damn so they need to just say one free product it don't matter what it is in the store and that's it because all the money that we spend on bath and body work products like boo give me something for free okay like really for real for real not just no fun size product not just um you know something like a little candle holder that's under 16.95 no like give me the candle that's 20 some dollars that y'all don't really don't need to have for 20 some dollars but anyway i see i'm going on a rant and i'm just gonna stop right there <laughs> but anyway i moisturized my body down with with this oil and i paired it with my satin slippers like i don't know if y'all even have this have y'all talked about this have y'all smelled it but this is a good time and the ingredients is well fragrance notes is white rose dreamy jasmine and airy musk and y'all already know it'd be the musk for me okay so yes i paired these two together and it was such a good time like for real for real it was such a good time mm, it, is, it smells really good and we don't talk enough um about the satin slippers not that i know of i haven't really heard people talking about the satin slippers but i'm gonna talk about it because i think it's a good time no, I don't think they have it right now. This is just probably a one-time thing. I don't know. Because you know how Bath & Body Works do. The, they'll bring certain items back. Of course, they have their oldies but goodies that they always bring back to the SAS. And mind you, listen, we have what coming up? We have Candle Day coming up. I don't know if I'm going to participate in Candle Day. Are you guys going to participate in Candle Day? Y'all let me know down in the comment section below. Because that's always what? Is it the first Saturday of? I do believe it's the first Saturday of december and that's coming up really really soon so i have so many candles here in my family's place and also plenty of candles in storage so i don't need to buy another candle okay i'm gonna tell you right now i don't need to buy another candle okay i'm just gonna tell you all that because i don't know what i'm gonna do i probably won't even participate but if i do go i'll take y'all with me but anywho Y'all probably like, girl, can, just get through the daggone scent <laughs> fragrance learn combo of the day. I'm coming. I'm coming. All right. So, after I moisturize on down, okay, from here on down, I moisturize. Because up here in this area, I moisturize with something else. But anywho, we're not talking about my skincare. We're talking about body care. So, then I went in with my girl that I haven't used in a while. It ain't been, that, I guess it has been a while, like for real, for real. In the stars. I love the packaging. Listen, the packaging is so pretty. The packaging is so pretty. And it's just a beautiful scent. Like, I'm about to tell you what it has in it, okay? No worries. I'm going in. Mm, it just smells so good, okay? Now, listen, let's see here. The fragrance notes is Starflower Sandalwood Musk. Sandalwood Musk. Uh huh. Um, Sugared Tangelo. White Argowood. And Radiant Amber. Listen, I love me some Amber. And it's a lot of products that I have that have Amber in it. 
I love sandalwood. I love musk. I love patchouli. I love vanilla. It's like a lot of scents. I love saffron. I know saffron ain't in this, but I'm just saying, like, I'm just naming some things that I'm just thinking about, like, yeah, I love those kind of scents. Yeah. It's a lot of scents that I love. Pear. I'm looking at some pistachio. Mm. This is strawberry. Mm-hmm. But anywho, um, <laughs> that's just the name of few. So, yes, I spray my body down in this, and I also spray... Did I spray my clothes down in this? And this. I'm not sure, because it's either I spray my clothes down with this, because sometimes I will spray my clothes in both the fragrance mist and the perfume, or I would just do it for the perfume and just spray my body down with the perfume and the fragrance. So, I'm not sure what I did this morning, but in the stars, how you doing? How you doing? Good? All right. Mm-hmm. So, anyway... That was the fragrance uh, mist. And then, boo, last but not least, I went in with my, what is it called? Hold on, because I have it over here on my iPad. It's called, the company is called Police To Be, I believe. Or, no, it's called Police. Police. And then the name of it is called To Be The Queen. I love this. Like, seriously, I know it looks kind of scary because it's a skull. Like, for real, for real. I was kind of like, leery, like, should I even get this? Huh? Should, um, should I get this because it's a skull? But I do have three of those. One is the Exotic Jungle. The other one is, what is it called? I also have To Be Sweet Girl, which is a pink glitter one. I was going to use that today. But I was like, no, I'm going to go with this because Into the Star, In the Stars, and my satin slippers, like, all of that, I believe, like, it just goes well with this, too. So, yes. Queen. No, what is it? To be the queen. Because it's, like, police. To be. And then it'll say whatever it is. So, police. To be. And then it'll say exotic jungle. Police. To be. Sweet girl. Police. To be. The queen. And I think this is really good. Smells really good. I'm about to spray it on down. I've had this for a few years at this point. Mmm. It just always oh, smells so good, y'all. Like, for real, for real, I got this from FragranceNet.com. They have all the police to be. Like, you just look up police and you will see all. They have men's fragrances as well as women's fragrances. And this one actually came out in 2013. 2013, this bad boy been around, Okay. Um, it says this deeply euphoric fragrance is ideal for bold women mm -hmm, who are not afraid of a little mystery. Deep, intriguing notes of vanilla, pineapple, jasmine, peach, and red berries combine for a rich, impeccable, impeccable <laughs> balance and unmistaken and unmistakably. <laughs> feminine scent this casual fragrance is uplifting exotic oh exciting not exotic exciting mysterious complex of oh and explosive declare your queenship with every spray of this crown worthy scent and i'll tell you it really does smell good like for real. and for the price of it they have only available the 1.3 what is this? Is this a 1.3? Oh, hold on. Let me look on the bag. This is a 4.2. Oh, I mean, it is big. It is big. I mean, of course, it ain't big as my head because, you know, I got a big head. But anyway, this is, um, they only have it for the 1.3. So that's like the small one. Probably like how my, um, let me show y'all. Matter of fact. Okay, <laughs> so I have this one. This one is the sweet girl, queen to be sweet girl. And this one, oh my goodness, hold on. Oh, it's a 4.2 as well. Both of these are 4.2 and I'm guessing because this has a crown on it, it looks, but yeah, they're the same size, 4.2, 4.2, but it is, just looks bigger to me, probably because of the crown. And this is to be sweet girl, sweet girl. 
And then I have this one, which is a, what is this y'all, hold on. This one is a 2.5. I thought this was, okay, so uh, <laughs> the one that I have available is a 1.3 and it says price with coupon is $11.99. So anywho, so this is ex Exotic Jungle. This is the Sweet Girl and then the Queen, okay? Yeah, y'all, uh -huh. did y'all wanna know, uh, before we end this, I'm gonna go ahead and tell y'all what the uh, Sweet Girl smells like. This one, the 4.2 uh, tester is $15.59. And then the, if it's not a tester, of course, it um it's a little bit more expensive, which is nobody has touched it. It's just in a, you know, the packaging, plastic, the probably, it's $19.19, which is still cheap. So the um, details of this is, it says it's a fruity floral fragrance of 2B. Sweet Girl is an elegant fragrance for women launched in 2020 by the Design House of Police. This scent features notes of or from orange, bergamot, and black currant. I love me some black currant for real. The fragrance has a soothing center with notes from coffee, cyclamen, never heard of that one, cyclamen, and jasmine. The base is a burst of freshness from cashmere wood amber and broxen and patchouli like this is a good time for real this is a good time you gotta take this off and if you get the um t this is actually a tester that i had bought because i wanted the cheaper you know i'll usually get testers when i get go from uh fragrance.net i have bought like the ones that are full price or whatever um of course they use a coupon but I like to get the testers only because they're just a little bit cheaper. Like this is four dollar, almost four dollars cheaper to get this, and it still has so many products. It's just that wherever it's been being tested at, it don't have like the full four point two ounce in it. But when I tell you this smells good, really good, like seriously. All right, so that's what that smells like, and then the exotic jungle. This one I love this one as well. So cute. I think this is so cute. I think it's so adorable. Okay, so hold on one second. Let me get into. Is it gonna let me do it or what? Stop be acting up. And I don't know why. Like for real. Hold on, y'all. Bear with me one more time. Oh, now it wants to pop up. It's popping up. <laughs> okay. Let's go to the product description. And this one uh, came out in 2019. The scent notes, it says, uh, the sweet, leathery, and exotic fragrance of 2B Exotic Jungle for women is a fascinating feminine fragrance. At the top of this 2019 scent are notes from black currant, plum, and lemon. The fresh, mm, the heart, is fresh with notes from osmanthus or osmanthus, jasmine, and heliotrope, while the base is distinct with notes from patchouli, suede, and vanilla. And when I tell y'all, listen, I need Queen, the Queen Boo Boo, and um, Sweet Girl Gong Exit Sage Love because I need to spray exotic jungle. Uh huh. It smells good, y'all. Like, for real, for real. I just need y'all to go ahead and try these different scents. Because they smell good and it, very affordable. Like, Police to Be is very affordable. Very, very affordable. So, anywho. Mm-hmm. That concludes my fragrance learning combo of the day of day number 51, y'all. Yes. Happy Thanksgiving to each and every one of you guys. I am hoping that tomorrow I will be able to vlog, not vlog, mm. um, not saying that I won't vlog, I don't know if I'm going to vlog tomorrow, but I'm hoping that I will be able to put up another fragrance slayer combo of the day, and if, of course, if I do, we'll be on day number 52, and I don't know what I want to be smelling like on Thanksgiving, but I'm going to be smelling good, mm -hmm. and I know you are too. Alright y'all, it's time to do what? Chit chat down below. Let me know what is your fragrance learning combo of the day, sis. And also, share, share, share this video with any and everyone 
Why? Because it's free.net. It's free.com and it's free 99. It won't cost you a thing. Just click that subscribe button and also make sure you're, um, you have your notifications turned on. If you like to do that, I'm one. I don't like to turn my notifications on for hardly anything. I ain't going to, <laughs> I ain't going to, cause it gets on my nerves. Boom, 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 boom. Every time somebody do this, boom, 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 boom. But anyway, if you are a notification person, make sure you have your notification bell turned on. So you won't miss another video from your good sis. And also, give me a big thumbs up that lets me know you like these types of videos. And that's it. That's all. I love you guys for watching. And I will catch you guys tomorrow. And